As many women know firsthand, motherhood can change absolutely everything. CBS News correspondent Mika Brzezinski has been searching high and low for women who refuse to fit into ordinary mommy molds. Yes, morning, they, they actually make having children a plus in their new product projects, Hannah. Some mothers are finding out that their children actually give them an edge and a motivation to accomplish new things that they never thought of doing before. So this is the first story in a new series we're calling Cool Moms. Shortly after Jennifer Nicole Lee delivered her second child, she looked in the mirror and staring straight at 190 pounds, asked herself a question. Who am I? Where did I go? I used to be so young, pretty, energetic. Then she did a brave, life-changing thing. What she took I a picture of herself in a future bikini. So what do you see when you look at that picture? I see someone who is struggling, who is trying, who is a good mother. However, she needed to be the mother of herself. I looked at that every day, and I just got on a mission. Jennifer Nicole Lee. That little Polaroid went a long way. A year and 70 pounds later, Jennifer was crowned Miss Bikini America. After being pregnant, breastfeeding, or fat the past five years of your life, putting on a bikini and actually looking good, I was loving it. Though it took hard work, the rewards and recognition that followed were especially sweet for a girl who'd been battling her body her whole life. Manja Manja was our motto. We ate morning, noon, and night. I was always chubby growing up. I was always on the large side, Italian family, we love food, and I really had to retrain myself and recondition myself to break all those old habits that have been ingrained in me. La tigra. Fitness contests, calendars, covers, all followed the amazing transformation of this young mother. Not to mention a book deal and fitness DVDs. Give yourself me time. Me time. Mm -hmm. So I came to Miami to learn the secret. From a gym right in her house, Jennifer showed me how she keeps fit. I like to do smarter, not harder exercises. You're working the lower body and the upper body all at the same time. Am I doing it? This is just old school moves. And it wasn't a quick fix approach. It wasn't a four week diet. Fitness is not an event, it's a process. I've got to do the laundry. Oh my gosh, I have to, I have to keep at it. For me, it's about how strong am I? Can I lift up my own furniture or do I have to call for a guy to come help me? Am I able to tote my toddlers up and down the stairs? One. Jennifer has even designed fitness routines that include her squirmy toddler, though she may have a hard time when he turns 18. Do you think you'd be here today if you didn't have kids? I think, actually I know that that gives me an edge. It gives me more credibility and a little bit more, oh she's legit, she's a real woman. I don't live in the gym, I'm there four times a week if that, or I do a little quick 20 minute exercise routine in my house. I like efficient, effective workouts, which I've designed myself, that does allow you more time with your children, more time with your loved ones, and that's the key. On the nose. And her kids say that is way cool. <laughs> She's too much. She was killing me, Hannah. So look for more <laughs> cool moms in the coming weeks, including a stunt mom, a boxing mom. Mothers can do anything, and they actually have their children as their inspiration, which I yeah. like. <laughs> I think all moms are cool, but look at this calendar. Uh, this is incredible. So does perfect. she absolutely live in the gym? She says she doesn't. Four times a week, 20, wow. 20 minutes only, she says. She says people ask her if she's an athlete. She says, yes, I'm a mom. There you go. Mika Brzezinski, thanks. There you go. Coming up next.